Want to save money and the planet? Consider putting solar panels on your roof, which might be free. This is not an ad, we promise there's no hook. Here's what you need to know. Solar is getting really cheap. 30, 40 years ago, you know, solar panels were hundreds of times more expensive than they are today. Progressively, as the technology has evolved, solar panel prices are coming down at 10 to 20% a year. Many states are incentivizing solar, which might make installation free. It's actually a rare time where we're able to offer solar with no upfront costs. The incentives are still really strong, especially here in the state of New York, and even particularly in the city of New York. We're capturing the federal tax incentive, which is the ITC, the investment tax credit. And thank goodness that was actually extended for a couple more years. That's why our industry is still in triple digit growth. And then with that brings about competition within the industry. So with that competition, then everybody needs to become better. The following states are offering power purchase agreements to solar companies, where the companies will own and install the solar panels on your roof and then sell the power back to you instead of using a traditional utility company. Often having solar means lower utility bills. For no money out of pocket, the average homeowner is going to save somewhere around $300 to $1,200. It's fantastic. Unfortunately, no, not all homes are right for solar. Uh, there's a certain amount of sunlight and then overall viability that a roof needs to have. Is it south facing, east and west or fine? What's the pitch? What's the condition of the shingles? However, we've installed homes over 100 years old. And as long as the homeowner properly maintains the house and the electric system that's in the home, we can move forward to installation. And yeah, solar is really good for the environment. On average, your house will save over 300,000 pounds of carbon dioxide over the next 30 years. So it's the largest environmental impact that they can have. When one person goes solar, the neighbors go solar. Then when the next door neighbors go solar, then the end of the street. And then you just start to fill it in all across different streets. And then we go there and you see that same effect. But let's say you live in an apartment. There still can be solutions for you. Look at the link in the description to learn about community solar options. Thanks.